For Crema Media's Mining Weekly, I'm Paige Muller. Joining me is TRI Environmental's African Subsidiary Director, Nadia Minard, to discuss the establishment of Tri Africa's Environmental Services. Okay, Nadia, so tell us a little bit about when you were established as TRI Africa. We opened our offices um, on the 1st of July this year. Um, you're actually our very first interview, so thank you so much. Um, yeah, so we are very young still. Okay, you know? it's very exciting. But now it's common knowledge that um, the South African economic environment hasn't been so friendly to investments lately. Uh, tell me a little bit about why TRI Environmental chose to open up a subsidiary in Africa now? The main reason for us opening a subsidiary in South Africa was due to the fact that our water um, legislation has changed um, late last year. Um, this has given us the opportunity uh, to grow our market due to the fact that um, if you build are building a new facility um, and you apply for a water license, then it has become a red, uh, um, regulation that you have to do a leak location survey to prove that the, the facility that has been built is, is actually leak free, um, which then opened a new venue for us um, and a lot of opportunities within our industry. All right, earlier you mentioned to me that mining is one of your bigger markets. Tell me a little bit about what you offer the mining industry in particular. Okay, so what what we really do is um, we've got two components. The one component is really to focus um, during the installation process, um, assuring that the quality of, of the installation is in accordance with um, South Africa regulations and standards as well as the international standards. So just making sure that the correct tests are done when it has to be do done and we actually then verify that. Mm -hmm. um, after this whole process and uh, when, when the installation is finished, usually um, th there is some backfilling that mm -hmm. has to take place. Um, and during the backfilling process, that is the way the most um, damage takes place. Mm -hmm. Um, and because it's covered, you can't, cannot see it with the eye. So um, when we are doing our survey, we d then come out and we look for, for any holes. Uh, we open them, we repair it, and we close it, uh, giving the, the owner of the facility the peace of mind that his facility is really leak-free. Um, and to make sure that, that we are not going to, or they are not going to have legislative issues. Yes. Okay, yeah. definitely. How many other facilities do this right now, this quality uh, testing? Well, um, TRI Africa is the only subsidiary in, in South Africa or even the whole of Africa that provides this uh, service at the moment. Okay, very interesting. And what makes your service offering so strong and unique? Um, I think it's... Um, because of we, we have uh, I, TRI Africa really has a very big backup um, with technical backup in, in mm. the U USA and the passion of um, making sure that we protect our environment and our water sources. Okay, well, thank you for doing your very first interview <laughs> with us here at Mining Weekly. We're very, very happy to have you. That was TRI Africa's director, Nadia Minna, discussing the launch of TRI Environmental's new African subsidiary, TRI Africa.